Hello, and welcome to this tutorial. In this video we will go through how to use the counter function blocks in Step 7 Somatic Manager. To add the counter function blocks we open up the counter folder. I will add one count up block and one count down block. We have to name the block with C followed by a number. Each one have to be individual. The CU and CD input is a boolean input which will make the block count up or down by 1 when triggered. I will add a normally open input tag here. The PV input is preset value. Here we can add a value that we want to trigger once the input named S is triggered. To add a value we type C hashtag followed by the value we want to add. And on the input named S I will add another input tag from the PLC. The input called R is for reset the counter's value back to zero. Here I will also add an input tag from the PLC. CV is a real value that keeps track of how much the block have counted up for. We could add a tag here but I will leave it open. Somatic Manager will show how much the block counted up for anyway. I will now download the program to a simulation and test it out. As you can see if I trigger the S input it will set the block's value to 5. Else if I trigger my CU input it will count up by 1 for each time I trigger it. And the R input will reset the block back to 0. The countdown block works just the same just that it counts down instead of up. So I will trigger my S input first to add a value of 5, then trigger my CD input to count it down. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you liked the video give it a thumbs up and subscribe.